In Home Alone 2, Lost in New York, there is a small cameo from Donald Trump, and director Christopher Columbus recently talked about how that cameo came to be. Quote, like most locations in New York City, you must you just pay a fee and you are allowed to shoot in that location. We approached the Plaza Hotel, which Trump owned at the time, because we wanted to shoot in the lobby and we couldn't rebuild the plaza on a soundstage. Trump said, okay, we paid the fee, but he also said the only way you can use the plaza is if I'm in the movie. So we agreed to put him in the movie, and then when we screened it for the first time, the oddest thing happened. People cheered when Trump showed up on screen. So I said to my editor, leave him in the movie, it's a moment for the audience. But he did kind of bully his way into the movie. So of course, (laughs) we all know what happens next. Trump had to fire back saying this on his social media platform, True Social. He says, 30 years ago, how time flies. Director Christopher Columbus and others were begging me to make in the cameo appearance in Home Alone 2. They rented it. They rented the Plaza Hotel in New York, which I owned at the time. I was very busy and I didn't want to do it. They were very nice, but (laughs) above all, persistent. I agreed. And the rest is history. That little cameo took off like a rocket. And the movie was a big success and still is, especially around Christmas time. People call me whenever it is aired. <laughs> now, however, 30 years later, Columbus, what was what was his real name? Question mark in parentheses, put out a statement that I bullied myself into the movie. Nothing could be further from the t- truth. That cameo helped to make the movie a success. But if they felt bullied or didn't want me, why did they put me in and keep me there? For over 30 years. Because I was and still am great for the movie. That's why. Just another Hollywood guy from the past. Looking for a quick fix of Trump publicity for himself. 